So as you can see here, if you actually look in woody substrates like this, you can see small little holes. And these are called emergence holes. And these would kind of be for um, small beetles and wasps and things that live deep within the wood as larvae. Environmental science, it's really quite a broad topic. Um, it's really where you're looking at the environment, um, climate issues and solutions, and you're looking at how, I suppose, organisms interact with their environment as well. And that includes animals, flora, but also us human beings as well. Here we're actually in one of the habitats that we would have visited as students, uh, known as Dangan. And we got to do a lot of work here where we would have classified the woodlands. We also would have looked at Menlo Castle and did some bat walks as well. And uh, we get to kind of classify the habitats, understand what's here, how to sample it, why it's important, and how we would conserve those habitats as well. What I really enjoyed about the course and I thought really benefited me in my future career was the multidisciplinary nature of the course. So in first year, we were given a real kind of foundation in the basic sciences. But we also did other important uh, modules like environmental legislation, um, climate issues and solutions. And then in year two onwards, you had the ability to really tailor your degree towards your own interests. So for me, I went towards nature conservation and also invertebrate ecology as well, which I find really interesting. I absolutely enjoyed the course. It was probably the best four years of my life. Um, I really had a small class. We got on so well. The lecturers were great and it really set my career path. 